keep it secrets to different bills. Hey, don't go dim me, you need it, I got it listed here. Yeah. You wanna make it, I'll show you just how to make it here. Yeah. I got all the rarest bills, and I ain't done yet. Yeah. We're from the finish to making bills like a prospect. Flow space and slashes to catching us with a lot threat. You keep the medals, cause the real ones coming up next. Only scratch the surface. Still, they try to drag my name in dirt, they try to bring me down. See me when you ain't like me. Yo, what's good, my nephews and nieces? This is your favorite uncle, Uncle Demi, and today I have another special banger for you, all right? Today we're gonna talk about how to make a combo guard, but before we get into the video, make sure you drop a like and subscribe, as like of the video puts the video to the recommended, and of course subscribe and put you in Naughty Game for the daily uploads. Without further ado, let's hop straight into the video, all right? So, let's go ahead and get this out. First and foremost, let's talk about left to right handed. We know where we're going. We're going left handed, because I'm left handed, all right? Um, now, shooting guards, we're gonna go shooting guard with the position 6'6", six, six, because I think 6'6 six, six is a, like the sweet spot for the heights. 180 pounds with a seven foot two wingspan, right? Um, and theoretically, yeah, I mean, seven foot two, or you could max it out. I think you can max it out. Let me make sure you can max it out. Yeah, let's go ahead. No, 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 because we gotta go 63 straight. All right, cool. Go 181 and max out your wingspan. I like that better. Let's go 181 with the seven foot three wingspan, maxing it out, all right? Now, let's go ahead down here to our physicals our speed we want to go 85 on the speed um i just feel like you know trying to get as much speed as i possibly can would have been great so that's what i did now at the end of the day it's all predicated on the way that you want to play in your preference um but i feel like 85 is going to be really good and the same thing for our acceleration i decided to go 85 on the acceleration also okay um keep in mind like you're not able to get speed booster any higher or anything like that so it's going both of these speed booster and blow by are both going to be silver because of the ball handles that's why i didn't go higher than that so if anybody's asking like why don't you go 86 because you can't get speed booster and go right i got both of them on silver now we're all going to go 63 on the strength just to get our physical handles on silver um to be able to just be a little bit more physical to break those clamps defense is extremely strong this year we all know about that vert at a 75 i feel like 75 vert is always a sweet spot for most guards and then, of course, we're going to go 93 on our stamina for our handles for days and our 94 feet, okay? And workhorse. Now, when it comes up here, you already know what we're doing, man. We're going 80 on that driving layup. We all know how good layups are this year. So, let's not even try to make it switch it up. Let's just keep it at 80, get that pro touch on Hall of Fame, and cook up. Now, again, if you want to take it down, I have no problem with that. Um, as long as it doesn't change the name, you can take it down. I know some people aren't really big on the layups. They don't care about it. If you don't care about it, fine. Just drop it down. Put put your attributes somewhere else. I say this all the time. I do not want to cookie cut nobody. I just give you the template of how to make a build to get the name. And, of course, you can, you know, do whatever you do best to get the build to where you like it. And it's your more suited for your play style. Um, we are going to go 75 on a driving dunk. Um, the reason being is because 75 uh, driving dunk will give you Giannis dunk packages because we will have a 75 standing. So you will be able to get the Giannis dunk package. But 75 is kind of right there on the tip of getting some of the most elite dunk packages and then the next tier of course from 75 would be 84 okay so that's where you get that big jump so in my opinion 75 is there if you're not trying to get a contact dunk just stop at 75 i already said this we're going 75 on the standing dunk to get the Giannis dunk package but also the standing dunks are really strong this year so it makes sense to be able to get those animations if you can't get the driving dunk you can't get the layup just stop on the rim and just get a standing dunk you get precision dunker on bronze, fast switch on bronze, rise up on bronze, and of course, aerial, aerial wizard on go. Okay, now our mid range, we're going 76 on our mid range, and we're going to go 77 on our three ball. Right, you can't go no higher than that, unfortunately. But at the end of the day, who cares? This is a really good build when it comes. And again, like I said, I have a high flyer, and my high flyer has a 77. And just go ahead and throw JT Thor base on that thing, man, and cook up. Like, I mean, really, it's not that hard to shoot, right. Get your lethal hot zones, get your hot zones and your lethal hot zones, and you're going to be perfectly fine shooting, man. I'm telling you, like, just get to the spots where you know you got your lethals and shoot them threes, man. Like, it's not hard at all. Um, so at the end of the day, I feel like 77 is good. Now, the 76, I got that because I wanted to get the um, green machine and space creator on silver, so that's why I got that. And um, our free throw, we're going to go 84 on the free throw. Um, if you're playing in the rec, just makes sense. They'd be able to have that ability to hit your free throw. 71 is as low as I would go. So if you want to go 71, do that. Um, again, like I said, man, you can move your free throw around. Um, or again, if you play no rec, take your free throw all the way down as low as you can. Now, our pass accuracy, we're going 89 
on our pass accuracy to get Hilliburton's passing style. I think that's going to be really good, um, especially since this can be a primary ball handler. And to get that passing style is, is, is really calm. So um, at the end of the day, you still will get Dimer, Relay Passer, Special Delivery, and Break Starter all on gold. You also get the Needle Threader on silver, which again, I always talk about that. Needle Threader is really, really good. It calls a stun animation, so you do want to get that. Usually, I only have a 77 with bronze, going 89, getting on silver. You're going to tell the difference. And of course, we can't sleep on Bell Out. You finally get Bell Out um, with this um, um, going up to 89, you have Bell Out on bronze. Um, and then again, ball handle, 88 on the ball handle. So you can't, you, go, you can't go no higher than 88. But at 6'6", there's no need to go 92 and stuff because you do not get anything other than just handles for days. Okay, so handles for days on silver, I've been doing it for so long, I don't even, t I don't even care to even try to get gold or Hall of Fame. But if you want to you know, if, if you go higher than 88, it'll change the name. So you're pretty much right there. Now, this is going to be big. Coming up real soon, I don't know if it's going to be this coming up season, you want to try to get your speed with ball at 80. Why? Because Devin Booker dribble style is going to be coming out really soon. And Devin Booker dribble style just requires an 80 speed with ball. So whenever that comes out, you got to get it. So if you're making bills from here on out, and you know you can't get like all the other crazy ones, at least get an 88 because that dribble style is going to be very important. It's going to be really comp. Um, so <laughs> you want to make sure you can get that. Now, you do get blow by a speed booster and hyperdrive on silver. And of course, you get that triple strike on gold. Triple strike causes stun animations out of the triple threat. So um, to me, it just makes sense to be able to get that. But since we were trying to get Devin Booker dribble style, it didn't matter anyway, right? Because you only need a 77 speed with ball to get it. So I was able to knock that out. Perimeter defense. We're going all the way up to an 85 on that perimeter defense. So now you get silver clamps, um, 94 feet, ankle braces, dumb challenger, fast feet, pick dodger, and workhorse all on silver. So that's going to be really good. And then we're going to um, top it off with the 72 on our steel. That's going to give us glove, interceptor, and right stick ripper all on bronze, respectfully. So at the end of the day, man, we're looking at a really, really strong build all the way around. It has good physicals, good defense good playmaking above average shooting but again really it's good shooting because if you, you know like i said lethal and hot zones you cook and then you have really 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 good finishing so again and top it off you get a rare build name by doing this but like i said you can lower your free throw your layup um your standing dunk um maybe you want to drop your steel down to 60 instead of 72 like you can tweak this enough to where you can still put attributes where you want to go you just can't go higher than 77 maybe you want to get uh, more driving dunk or something like you know like that so i don't want like i said i don't want to cookie cut you you can do this the best way to your ability same thing with your speed acceleration you want to drop that down a little bit go ahead and drop that down there's no right or wrong answers here but um as you can see right here um again like i never i've seen every like two-way this and da 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 but just a straight up combo guard i think is actually pretty dope right so yeah i think that's just pretty insane to have the name combo guard um, but y'all let me know what y'all think about the name, what would y'all think about the build, and what would y'all change differently if you had to. Just keep in mind, changing attributes could change the name. So we're trying to get Combo Guard as a name. Let's put it down in the comment section, right? But other than that, it's your favorite old head, Uncle Timmy. I'll be back really, really soon with the banger, man. You know, when I say back soon with the banger, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm talking about tomorrow, man. I'm out.